In this video, we're gonna talk about some of the top five ways that you can make money online. We're gonna go over ways that you can make some extra income or even if you're looking to potentially start a business, then these are some options that you can start thinking about moving forward. Hey, what's up guys? My name is Chase and this is a Painting Pinterest Guide to Personal Finance and Investing. And I wanna make sure that we put out videos that you like. So if you do like this video, then make sure you hit that like button. If you dislike it, then dislike it and consider subscribing if you get some good information from this video. So let's jump right into the top five. And then just a little aside before we start the video, I did categorize these on the ones that I put for short term versus long term and the ones that I highly recommend versus the ones that I would recommend if you're looking for just some short term benefit. All right, so the first one is going to be more for a short term way to make some extra money and it's going to be to look for selling products online. So you're going to look to see if there's anything that you have around the house or something that you like to sell and or that you, you're interested in and then you could go ahead and make money online is by selling that product. So the way that you go about with this particular way of making money would be to start to look into ways that you can move forward with e-commerce stores, selling through online marketplaces like Etsy or Amazon and or drop shipping certain products. Now, if you're moving forward to Etsy, you're gonna create the product, you're gonna play it, post it onto Etsy and then people are gonna go looking for it. Same thing with Amazon. Or if you're looking for the drop shipping way of things where you don't have to necessarily have any type of inventory, but all you're gonna be working as is a middleman from getting the product from the supplier to the buyer. And you won't actually have to be it shipped to you. You would just, once they place the buyer makes the, the purchase, then you will go on to the drop shipping uh, supplier and then you will just send it directly to the buyer. And this is a great option because you will be able to not have to have any upfront costs and you can just directly get it to them and take all the, the work and the, the supply chain stuff out of it. I think this is a great option. There is a lot of work up front to make sure that you get all the logistics ready and taken care of. And there will be some potential advertising costs to it to make sure that your product is being advertised to the buyer and, and then continued use as that buyer then buys that transaction. You'll have to ensure that it's going to the right person. So this is a great option, but um, you have to make sure that you put in the correct appropriate amount of work at the very beginning. Okay, the next way to make some money online is to potentially move forward with some freelancing work on particular websites like Fiverr or Upwork. Now this is a great option and as long as you can get into some of the higher tiered, higher reviewed areas, then you will be utilized on a regular basis. But this is one of those things where your time is going to be replaced with money and so it's not really scalable in my opinion because you'll continue to have to put in the work to continue to make the money. Uh, but if this is something that you have any particular skills like uh, drafting or reviewing paper or um, have some sort of online marketplace, online market um, talent that you can utilize, then up, Upwork and Fiverr are great options for you. Especially if you know that clients are looking for programming, graphic design, writing, programming, anything like that, and you have those skills, then this is a great option for you. And one of the great things about freelancing is that it allows you to work from anywhere as well as it allows you to work at your own rates and at your own time. If you don't wanna do it at that time, then you can definitely take a break. Okay, so the next one that I'm gonna be talking about is gonna be affiliate marketing. And this is a way to make money is through affiliate links and marketing. It involves promoting a specific product and then getting that link out to somebody. And if somebody clicks on that link and then buys that product, then you're gonna get a little kickback from the, um, the producer of that particular product. So this one will also require you to have some sort of presence either on a social media website or be some sort of an influencer and then you put that information out to your followers or the people that continue to go to your website and then they click through there. You will need to have some sort of intro into this space otherwise the affiliate marketing might not work as well for you. But if you do have that option to have some sort of following behind you then it is a great way to build a passive income especially while you're sleeping people could be clicking those links and going and buying those products. Okay, so the next way that you can make some money online is to make some sort of digital product that you can post up somewhere and then the consumer can then buy that product and then utilize it and learn something from it. Now we're talking about something like some sort of e-product where you get e-books, courses, podcasts, printables, and even software. Somebody goes, they find what they are looking for, they buy your particular course, and then you get money based off of that course. Now I like this one because it is scalable because you make one course and multiple people can buy that one course and you can continue to make money off of that one. And then you build multiple courses that might build onto each other and it is like a stepwise approach and it is scalable. 
And then there's even options after you make that course and you're selling them. If you would like to sell the products, you can, but you can also sell the general brand name and sell it off to somebody else and go and build another one. So the options for this one is pretty great and you can do whatever you want with it. Okay, the next one and probably my favorite one is to become some sort of content creator, whether that's for YouTube, Twitter, uh, TikTok, Instagram, anywhere where you can go on there and have your own individual ideas and present something to a audience that they haven't already seen or expound upon something that they've already seen is a great option because the more that you build, the more that you can be able to influence and then that's when they start to pay you for that. So for us here at you and YouTube at the Apimetrics Guide, we are content creators trying to put out some more financial literacy for the college age student out there. And because we've been able to do this and meet so many viewers, we have been able to get paid advertising amounts on our videos from YouTube. And I think this is great because even though you may be watching this video right now, I actually may be sleeping and we're gonna be making money down the road. This content will stay up on YouTube and every time that there is an ad going on it, then there will be something that we will be getting off of it, which is great. It allows us to create more content for you guys and it allows us to continue to do things that we love to do. So in my opinion, being some sort of content creator is a great way to make money online because it gives you the ability to make this passive income that continues to build on itself because you continue to push people to other videos to learn more about it and it just continues to loop around and go back to the content. That's why I'm so passionate about this and teaching people ways to create some sort of passive income where they put all the work up front and then that that particular work will continue to compound on itself and continue to give you some sort of income in the future. So of course there are many different options out there to make money online, but these are some of the most popular and some of the most accessible options that you can go to make some sort of money online. And I just wanna make sure that you understand that creating these sources of income and making this money online, it will take some time, so be patient, continue to put the effort in, and it will pay off down the road. If you do have any extra tips or ideas or any recommendations for making money online, then go ahead and leave that down in the comments down below. And don't forget to subscribe and like if you do like it, if you dislike it, so that we know to make more or less of content just like this. And remember that we are here from your first penny to your first million. We'll see you next time.